I'm reading this man I'm not sure on the pronunciation, but that's how I think it's pronounced. This man recently. Where the main guy will craft himself or forge himself a weapon before each decisive battle or whatnot, so I think we'll not adopt that. That way I don't stick with just one weapon for the entire fucking game, you know what I'm saying? So for each major quest line that I tackle, for I love you. I'll I love, love craft the weapon. Even as man, great power. Just so that you know, it's a bit more involved in smithing, so it's not just a fucking thing that I do. Every other time, just because. Right now, we have the axe. I'm gonna go and get a fucking sword. I'll get the fucking sword. A dragon is attacking the western watchtower. You have to look right back outside in a minute. Take a good look around. Go I'm sale. sure you'll find what you're looking for. How's it yeah. going? What you got for sale? I like your relax. Hmm. Blades, so helmets, cool. pretty much this anything to suit your. I got one of them swords that could upgrade. It's not great now, but it'll get greater now. Get greater. Oh, get better. Games when you shoulder yourself in that you're fucking seen from the left side. I don't think I've seen that. See you, I like you. You're keeping up. The other two, however. No oh, signs of any dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened. And if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere, spread out and look for survivors. We need to know what we're dealing with. back. It's still here somewhere. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Guardsman, what happened here? Where's this dragon? Quickly now! Good thing I've got I don't know. Kinneret, save us. Here he comes again. Here he comes! Find cover and make every arrow count! Knock that fucking teeth out! If any of you want to take bets, you can give your 
coins to me. Fucking throw. Dead. Just don't know it yet. You're outmatched. Help you choke on your blood. Sure as shit that I had fire resistance. Fuck. Oh. was such a fucking good idea. I leveled up. Oh, yeah. I can't believe it. You're Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What do you mean? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. I think you might be right. Yes, I think I am. 
You can shout now. That can only mean one thing. You must be Dragonborn. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. Those who are the Dragonborn are them. Like old Gohaiba said to him, tell I've never heard of Gohaiba except him. Well, we're in a dragon tent. Just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the Dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. What do you say, Yerileth? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Yerileth. Tell us. Do you believe in this Dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a Nord. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting, what you just did. Must be. You really are dragonborn, then. Why did you see that? What the hell just happened? Are you okay? I... I don't... I don't know. You just sucked the soul right out of that dragon! <laughs> I can't explain it. I knew something was up after what happened at the word wall in Bleak Falls Barrow. You... You're... Dragonborn. Come on, let's go tell the y'all what happened. Damn. That's just... Wow. <clears throat> After you, I'll follow your lead. Mm -hmm. I'd rather enjoy our travels together. Same. Any thoughts? I've always preferred the villains. Okay, I guess. I just kill the fucking dragon, but sure. You like this Skyrim so far? It's certainly conversation. <laughs> differently civilized. I mean, it's charming in its own way, of course, but everything here feels purely designed to kill us, you especially. Is it really no different from your home? Are you kidding? Mind yourself, I grew up in a castle as a birthright claim to the throne. The servants took care of my every need. And my whole life, I was given a golden ticket to anything I wanted. Of course, the other students at the university hated me for it. Perfect princess with a perfect life, then. I miss the castle more than anything, though. I haven't been home in... ten years. Let's get going. Mm. Alright, little dragon. I always prefer the lap track than, you know, on account of my dragon, but, you know, <laughs> a little dragon could work too, I guess. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. We will be back. This is not over. 
We could do it like hey, right down, you know. Do you know how to push my buttons? Don't say it like that. You make it me feel like. It's the cloud district. I'm right behind anything? you. I mean, other than the odd comment. Let's talk about your heel. Yeah, no, that's that's it. I don't really have you anything lead. in particular. I'll follow. Stay here. Still here. Let's part ways. You'll be all right on your own. Good luck yeah. to you. I think I think I'll be fine. I like you, but um, yeah. What was I saying? I like you, but um, I fear you'll make the game too easy. What is like it? I didn't best? die once when fighting the fucking dragon, and it's a high-level dragon. I know how to watch other people helping and all that kind of shit, so what? Whenever I got low in health, she just healed me. I like it. But at the same time. Nah. I think you're not exactly supposed to be here in Skyrim. Well, with the way my mother's planned out for my life, I'm supposed to study magic for another 40 years to prepare for the throne. But I can study magic anywhere I like, and I'm a damn good witch. Sounds like she'd put a lot of pressure on you. Of course she has. She hasn't even seen me herself in over 15 years. My whole life she's always been busy handling the court affairs. But I don't really blame her. We're supposed to spend our entire lives preparing for the throne. It's an honor, not just a right. And once we're there, we spend our next three lives setting everything up for the next queen. It's a great shame to die on the throne, you know. It means we didn't have enough time to prepare for the next princess. Mm -hmm. What? That fucking bitch. I mean, her. I knew he was there. I could have smelt his fear the moment I entered the city. <laughs> save, save. We'll talk to you. Who are Need you? something? All right then. Good. You're finally here. The Yarl's been waiting for you. you Divines bless you. May the ground what you walk quake as you pass. The Enjoy your bears. visit to Dragon's Reach. We were just talking about you. you My were. brother needs a word with you. Uh. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? The Watchtower was destroyed and we killed the dragon. No, I killed the dragon. I think it is of a reward because I did kill the dragon. There's no question about that. It was a mighty deed. You've earned a place of honor among the heroes of White Run, but there must be more to it than that. Did something strange happen when the dragon died? 
Mm, dragon died to absorb some kind of power from it. So it's true. The gray beards really were summoning you. The gray beards. Masters of the way of the voice. They live in seclusion high on the slopes of the throat of the world. What do these gray beards want with me? The dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to, to focus your vital essence steps. into a thoom or shout. If you really are dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Hrothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as she may be, this cool I don't see any signs has. of her being this, what, dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Prongar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with her? That's the Greybeards' business. Not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. No matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, mm. I name you Thane of White Run. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal house carl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. Cool. Look at all this shit. Let's pawn it off. Yes. You see what all this shit is? Sort of white, white, white run is nice. I could use it, I could have Lily use it. But I think I'll just put it up as a display piece. Okay, I'm pressing, that's cool. What else do we get? I remember three things popped up. I think one was a great sword, but I think it's just despawned or some shit. What is it? Will your royal guardsmen come looking for you? They'll think I'll kill after you if they do see me with you. They might. They're just following orders, trying to keep me safe. Like they've always done. But I can't be around them right now. I need to be alone from them for a while. If they show up, I'll kill them before you could even notice. Is it wise to kill your own men? 
when I draw unwanted attention to us. Well, if they leave us alone, I won't have to kill them. But you know how persistent high elves are. Hmm. Are you having second thoughts about the throne? Choosing a different life? No, it isn't that. I love my family. And I'm proud to be a Kakeri princess. I just needed to get away from everything for a bit. Hopefully Skarum has the answers I seek. Let's get going anyways. Well... Hmm. What's left to do is just move on, I guess. Oh, wait, hold up. What else can I give? He's got a necklace slot that's open up. I don't have anything in particular to give. She can hold up. Better not be getting any smart ideas. Thane! Yeah, right. I don't like this one bit. She's not coming with us, right? Guardian, can we talk in private for a moment? Okay. Wrong. Now you're Thane. What about Lydia? You're not taking her along, are you? Why would that be an issue? Okay, okay. I'll try to get along. So what now? There's several options. One, we leave Lydia here and go to the Greybeards right now. Two, we purchase a house and have Lydia stay there to look after it while we're gone. Hell, you could even adopt that orphan kid that's been wandering around the city if you like. That would be the least you could do. Three, we take her with us. We'll take her with us. <sighs> okay, sure. Lydia might be a house Carl, but she's also a shield maiden. If she's anything like Irileth. Where we're going, what's not to like about having her around? The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. Long life to you, Thane. What does a house, house Carl do? As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. Mm. Follow. Lead the way. Still here. Let me give you some equipment. I'm at your service. Lead on. Yeah, that's I knew something was funny. <coughs> oh, 
the helmet don't match the rest of it. I'm sure shit it matched it when it was in inventory. Hmm. I don't like that. Oh well. Bit dark in it. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna keep it on for the entire journey until so I ever sleep. It'll take a minute. I will pop in for anything interesting that happens along the way though. Hey. I can do this thing, the red guard thing. You don't want to. Originally, I was going to show you all a nice little intro of me walking into this bitch, right? But then as soon as I did, I got attacked. By three mages and their summons. And immediately after that, two wolves behind this house. Anyways, this is the place we'll be calling our home. I think. Yes. Could murder a tanker to bail right now. And then from here, you get to, you know, essentially have an estate, run it, I think. I don't really know what the model entails, to be honest with you. All I know is. It entails us having a manor. And I'm guessing managing it and all that. Hopefully not everyone in this fucking area is hostile. You hostile? This isn't a good time. About this place. Of course. This is an impressive property. I understand you're interested in selling it. I'm sorry, but you don't seem to have enough gold to pay for that. What the fuck do you mean? You have no clue about my finances. I'm fully prepared to make you an offer. How much? 50,000 in gold right now. For that price? Sure. Do I even have that much? I'm when you've you actually that. got the coin, we can do business. That's twice as much as I have now. Oh, would you look at that? I suddenly have all of the money available. Wow, I really must have went out and grinded for that. That is so amazing Fine. of me. What? Of course. I'm sorry, but you... How much? For that price? Sure. Here you go. Wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. No, fuck off. Tour. Why the fuck is it so bright? House tour of the houses I can afford. I'm poor. <laughs> uh, I like his videos. Some of that nigga just bust out and they're making a full ass fucking songs at the end of his videos and shit. Okay, okay. Just got a bath. 
got closets and chests. That's cute. It's got kid beds. One, two, three, four, five, six. And a fucking dollhouse. It is not this building. I don't know what building that is, the dollhouse, but I thought it was this building. You might be thinking, but that's cheating! That's so unfair! Why did you give yourself all of that amount of money? You could have easily made it in game. Shut the fuck up. Let's take a hot bath. I'd like to wash all this dragon blood off me. Sure it is, right? I'm not gonna fucking read it. They got a kid's bedroom downstairs. I think the divines. We get to sleep on a real bed tonight. I'm assuming this is my bed. I hate to assume you know, it makes an ass out of you and me. But I'll have to assume this is my bed. Anyways, let's get this bitch up and running. Mm-hmm. You might be thinking, why does he have a potion and invisibility potion? to suck off y'all ball groups. I wanted to see what I would get. Kind of from the blood thing, the blood quest. If you remember <laughs> that itself. <laughs> uh, access book collect. Okay. Um, uh, I don't like the ability that I got. Deed of ownership. This deed proves it. Yeah. Oh god, this from the freaking bandit place. Sorry, I'm bored. Oh, that's too fucking bad. <sighs> Did I not read these things? Sorry, I'm bored. Yeah. Yeah. Why do I have all of this shit? Oh yeah, the manic mages. That's who have this shit. 